Ah, 26 year old Alana, I wish you could advise 15 year old Alana. Oh well. Good morning. I am Tunku Alana Kyra. I will be showing you ladies today how to look good and feel good about yourself using my makeup routine. So today I'll be using the Sephora Beauty Amplifier Smoothing Primer. Uh, take a big dollop of that. Mm -hmm. Put it all over your face, which is a little pimply. So welcome to prepubescent Alana. <laughs> Then we'll go in with our foundation. I'm using NARS. Um, it goes on really smooth. It fills all your pores, especially if you use a beauty blender. So I kind of rub it in first, and then I'll use the beauty blender to kind of push it into your skin. So that way it looks a little more natural, especially because I think a lot of people go out with makeup that's really great for like a photo shoot and looks really good in pictures. But then when you look at them, it's like they're caked in 20 layers of foundation, you know? And that's never a look you want to go for. Now we will use the Naked, yeah, Naked Heat Urban Decay Palette, which is my favorite, because they have all of these pretty gradients from like pink to purple. I will start with like a very bright white on the corners of my eye. Then I use the Lumber, Lumbre, I'm not really sure, which is like a nice peachy golden shimmer on the lids. And then usually I'll use a um, brush that comes with it. And I'll go for like a sand kind of color. This is low blow. Um, and you go over in the creases, so it kind of blends out. You have a bit of a gradient from the inside of your eye to the outside of it. Oh, why is my tongue coming out? I look like an old turtle. <laughs> okay, we're gonna use the other end of the brush and pick up a, a darker color. I'm thinking Fuego. Put it on the crease. Someone's going to look good tonight. Just to blend the other parts, I'll take a little bit of like a sh shiny pink. This one's called Dirty Talk. So this gives a kind of reddish romantic look. Now we're going to use our NARS Santa Fe color. I use it almost as a concealer. So you just take a little bit of that and you spread it all the way from the bottom of your eye all the way along your cheekbone so it gives you that much more like highlight and definition use a beauty blender which blends perfectly it's like it goes straight into your wrinkles of which obviously i have none uh just kidding i'm gonna keep pushing it in so that i don't just feel woke but i look woke that about does it Okay, we're gonna go with our bronzer, which is the best part because it makes me look all tanned and fabulous. This is the Anastasia Contour Kit, which is light to medium. Boom. Okay, now I'm using my Makeup Forever Liquid Eyeliner, which I'll just use on the lids of my eyes for a little definition. I remember when I was a teenager and I used to use one of those like thick black coal pencils and I just look like a raccoon because that was the, the style, you know? You put on as much as possible and you think you look all good and then you look at photos of yourself from like a Facebook memory and you're like, ah, 26 year old Alana, I wish you could advise 15 year old Alana. Oh well. <laughs> now we're gonna do the uh, mascara using Tarte Lights Camera Lashes. All right, so now I'm using Becca. I'm using a highlighter called Champagne Pop, which is my absolute favorite because the pigment is very strong. And the other day I dropped it, which was like the end of my world. Uh, but then all I used was a bit of ethanol or rubbing alcohol. And you crush up your, pig, um, your powder, you put this um, rubbing alcohol in it, and then it sets it straight back into shape. So if you guys ever drop your make makeup, it is not the end of the world. 
So we're gonna go in right on the cheekbone. After we've done the highlight, uh, I'm gonna start drawing on my eyebrows so that I don't look like I shaved them off. This is Shu Uemura. Shu Umura. I sometimes shift between using a hard pencil and a crayon. Today we go with hard pencil. And then you have eyebrows on fleek. For my favorite part, um, a bright red lip. I'm using the cream lip stain from Sephora, which is number 10. So now we've gone from skinny little lips, little french fries, to kissable Kylie lips. Last but not least, a setting powder because we don't want to look oily. And just like that, you are ready to go. So, hope you feel good about yourself. Go out there and kill it. Sephora, First Class Naya are doing a huge giveaway where you can stand the chance to win a thousand ringgit worth of makeup products, some of which I've used today. Uh, if you want to win, which of course you do, you should go to First Class's website, which is www.firstclass.com.my. Good luck and I hope you win.